hey, it's actually way better now. Nope, it's still an absolute piece of sh awesome night. Episode 5. Okay, let's just get this started. So, uh, it starts with uh, gang members trying to collect tribute money from this business owners of a bar. Yeah, of course, ev all the all the gang members are white men and the business owner is a person of color. Who knew? Who knew? So, oopsie, uh, they did not have enough to pay their dues. So, they're like, okay, screw it. We're gonna burn your table. Not the establishment, just the table. They're like, oh, Then, end of intro. Then, this is Carrie's mom. So, she works uh, most of the day. She's, she's super busy, and Carrie's like, Oh, we have a school event. We have a school luncheon this weekend. Are you going? Oh, yeah, I forgot all about it. Uh, let me see if I can change my work shift so that I can go. Carrie is like, Nope. No need, no need. It's it's uh, it's a used to school event anyway. No, I'll still find a way. But okay, yeah, it was like okay, sure, whatever. Then uh, the gang is like, okay, we need new leads. We need new leads again. We do the same crap. Then Steffi was like, okay, since uh we we don't know why Felix the Felix is the talent, why is the, the guy so old. I decided to check Cressida's financial transactions because, yeah, apparently she's so smart that she did not use an alias when making transactions. So on face value, she's fine, but, but behind the scenes, she was using shell companies to transact for the Court of Owls. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. Then, okay, I, I can probably hack them and... You will be able to trace an address. Then Harvey is contemplating. Hmm. Did I actually kill the mayor? I wonder. Oh, and uh, yeah, wife of third wheeler. No, sorry, mom of third wheeler comes in. Yeah, Harvey. Uh, I'm feeling horny. Let's bang. Uh, then. I know my husband came to you the other day. You did you spill the beans? Did you share, share our secret? Harvey's like, no, of course not. We were talking about security. Now no, get out. It's too uh, what do you call this? It's too early for us to bang. Then they get to the the gang gets to the address, and then Harper was like. Oh, we're here. And everyone was like, what? What's here? Oh, yeah, I used to work for this gang, apparently. The shell company leads to a base of the gang. With Apparently, she, did, she used to work for this gang, and she even dated one. And everyone was like, whoa. And yeah, for so she did not recognize, for some reason, the address of the gang she used to work to until they got there. Sure. Sure. Oh no, so what now what are we gonna do with that reveal? And yeah, Collins was like super bitter. It's like Why why did you work for a for a gang? I mean I mean Harper's really terrible, terrible character since the very beginning. Anyway, um what was I saying? Yeah, so they plan to breach this gang and uh Turner, thinking that he's so clever, he says, We're gonna Rob the mob. Right, whatever that means. I mean, this is a gang, not a mob. But let's rob the mob. Oh, okay, there we go. I even, I even, he feels so proud about it too. Rob the mob. Rob the mob? That's so dangerous, says Carrie. Come on, we gotta do this. If we take out, if we take them out, we also take out the court of owls. Okay, says Carrie. Okay, you guys go while I'm going to the luncheon. So Carrie was supposed to go too, but because they're gonna rob the mob. So he won't go. 
Carrie won't go and her mom is definitely not going because of her busy schedule and she was not able to adjust. Uh, okay. And Harvey and back at GED, this is their psychiatrist. So, um, I'm gonna summarize everything that happens here. I'm not gonna, not gonna show what happened in screenshots of this. this. Harvey was like, hey, psychiatrist friend asking for, asking for a friend. What if this friend of mine is like, has a separate subconsciousness and doing evil deeds that I am not aware of. And this friend kind of admitted to me. And I trust this friend is not telling the truth. This is for a friend. This is not me. I'm asking for a friend. And he's like, this is you, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it's me. How did you know? Yeah, because you're a terrible liar. And yeah, you're, you're, you're just making this up. You're just feeling traumatized. You're not actually doing this stuff. So I'm just going to give you meds and I'm, give, I'm giving you donation in support of your campaign to be our politician. Blah, 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 blah. Going. And, oh, and I'll say they're like thinking, uh, so we, we infiltrate the area. I mean, who would have known? Who would have known we're going to infiltrate the area of the gang? And Harper was like, Oh, that guy I dated, apparently he's the son of the leader. Wow, okay, you chose to tell them now. Son of the leader. And that's how I know all this stuff. And, but you didn't know the address of their location. Sure. So they decide, oh, let's sneak into their truck so that we can get in. And that actually happened. That's not, no more questions. <laughs> let's just go. Let's just go with it. And okay, this is Steffi's mom. Hey, Steffi, I'm so proud of you. And yeah, okay, that's it. That's it for now. Uh, okay, so guys, how do we get in this warehouse? Which I believe that's where the money, money laundering for the Court of Owls takes place. Charge in and punch. And they get in with uh, Harper hacking the door. This is the only door. Apparently, if something catches on fire or this warehouse only has this door, there's no other smaller door or, or emergency if something catches on fire. I don't know, but okay, let's go with it. Okay. Um, ooh, I wonder where's the safe? Where's the safe for all the Court of Owls money laundering activities? It's maybe, maybe the safe is a little conspicuous. Maybe it, you might need to hide it a little bit better. But okay, it's the safe where the money or the ledgers are. And oh, there's more money here as per Duella. Beside this fan that's not going to be of use later, convenient. And Duella was like, let's keep all this money to ourselves. No, Carrie says, no, that's the money of the people of Gotham. We shouldn't keep it. So it's back and forth, back and forth, blah, 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 morality about what to do with the money. And, oh, okay, while you guys were talking, I'm going to hold you up, says the boyfriend, the former date of Harper. Yeah, so this is the son of the owner of the owner the son of the head of the gang sorry yeah um so they go on this oh okay uh transition to steffi i'm such a stunning and brave girl uh oh my daughter's so stunning and brave while she's doing that i'll feed my drug addiction while she's making a speech and this is his the history teacher of Carrie. And then... Hey, you know what? Carrie's been cutting class. And this is the mom of Carrie who makes it to the event. It's like, what? Then uh, Harper was like, hey, remember the old times back when we were dating? And... 
You freaking left me. You freaking left me. That because of that, I'm gonna call for reinforcements, which you should have done. Like five years ago. You can't do that. Then uh, while uh boyfriend former boyfriend is still showing uh pulling a tantrum. Carrie throws a batarang, which she should have done like 20 years ago. And preferably before the guy calls reinforcements, but okay, for convenience sake, he calls for reinforcements. And smack, punch again, so that he goes unconscious. Then the gang members, because of the call, they're, yeah, they're banging through this door, thinking that by smacking it, it's gonna break eventually. Then... Let's pay tribute to this uh, beautiful image to see that they're all white men. Yep. White guy, 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 white guy. Yeah, they're all white males. Uh, hey guys, stop banging the door or else we'll kill your leader. So they stop banging the door. Then Colin's like, how could you work for this gang? How why would you do something like that? Oh okay. Uh Harper then says I did it so that you can have surgery for your transition. No joke. That's that's her reason. Then all of a sudden it becomes okay. Oh, uh okay, mom. I think you need to head home. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna throw this key to the lake to eliminate all the evidence that I actually killed the mayor. Ooh, who's this guy? Who's this mysterious caller? Let me answer as, so that it won't trigger anything for, out of me? Or it won't trigger anything out of me? It won't trigger my other personality maybe? But So anyway, I'll answer the call. Then Carrie's mom calls when she finds out from her history teacher that she's been cutting class oh and asking carrie why is she not in the event carrie's like oh i'm doing busy doing stuff doing school stuff then so the gang calls in the police who are surprise surprise corrupt and are also white males so who would have known oh my god evil white males <sighs> okay so what we'll do with all this money is that we'll put it in the van and when they open the door we see that all in the van <laughs> go after the oh okay so go after the van go after the van so the cops are after the van what do they do because like they can't get away from the cops they throw the cash out they i don't know it's to impede their it's either to impede their vision or to eventually have people gather and get the money despite the speed of these vehicles so they're throwing they're, yeah they're throwing yeah look at that they're going so fast even even if people saw the cash, they're like, they're not going to be able to impede their path. I don't know. Okay. Just, yeah, it's throw the cash, redistribute the wealth. I, I wish I'm making this up, but <laughs> even, when, even when I'm intoxicated, I can't make this stuff up. The well was like, stop throwing the cash. We're wasting money. And she's right. And she's right. But ev and everyone else seems like, Hee. let's throw the money away. Let's throw, redistribute the wealth to the people of Gotham. Then there's one more bag, one more bag left. As if that's going to make a difference. It's like, the well's like, no, 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 don't throw it. No, we're going to throw it. We're going to throw it all the money away. Which they do. And it, eventually it worked. 
it miraculously some people event there was suddenly there's enough people in one location near enough to block the cops and they get away and when they get back to base they tune into the news Gotham Knights Paul Robin could act they redistribute the Gotham Knights redistributed the wealth the Gotham Knights are there to replace the Dark Knight. The Gotham Knights are there to stop the two-faced politician. They called us the Gotham Knights. And Carrie sneaks back to her house to avoid her mom. And she pretends to be sleeping. Then she comes in. Oh, she's sleeping. I won't just I won't ask her why she's cutting class and coming home so late. She's not doing anything wrong. So I'll just let her sleep. I mean, I don't know if my child were doing not going to school and go, coming home really late, I'd be very concerned enough to wake my child up and talk about it. But no, oh, okay, just let her sleep. I mean, she's doing fine. She, she's cutting class, it's fine. Fine. And Steffi Oh my god, mom, why are you such a drug addict? Oh, uh, what you were doing is so bad, like joining up a gang and committing crimes and letting people suffer and making, making money. That's so bad. But, but, it's, but because it's for my transition, it's good. It's okay now. It's morally correct. Hey, Turner, don't forget. It's a love square, not a love triangle. So if you feel, uh, I know the feeling of being betrayed. So need anything? No. Just break the rules. And this ledger we found in the safe, it's codes. It's codes. We got to decipher the codes. And Harvey wakes up in... Ooh, where could this be? Why, why, is he, why doesn't he have his shirt on? Surprise! We banged. Harvey's like, no, we can't do it anymore. We can't do it anymore. But you're the one who made multiple calls. Oh yeah, she's right. But I didn't make these calls. End of episode. Oh. God, end of episode. <sighs> okay, uh, yeah. This show keeps getting worse and worse. Probably the worst one. But yeah, uh, Gotham Knights episode 5. What do you guys think? And... Uh, such a shit show. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.